All right, folks, welcome to an episode of Retro Stuff. Today we're going to be doing one I didn't ever think I'd actually be doing on the channel, which is Skull Fang. I played this a long time ago in an arcade at Fort Knox. So we're going to go ahead and jump in here. going to select a bomber and a bomber pilot. We'll do two speed. The music's loud, but the music's way better than the sound effects anyway, so I'm just going to roll that way. Okay, we got missiles. Okay, well, we'll just do it this way. The sound effects are rolling down slightly, but, uh, wow. The music's rocking and the sounds barely exist. If you guys ever want me to play this again, I might have to rebalance that, but... I remember... Playing the absolute hell out of this game when I was out at Fort Knox, and, uh... It was not a common game for some reason. Um, there weren't machines of it around a lot of places, and it never got a release that I was aware of. Apparently, and this is kind of annoying since I have a Saturn, uh, apparently it got a Saturn release at one point, but uh, I don't know if it ever got a stateside release or it was a Japanese only title. If it was a Japanese-only title, it wouldn't matter if I could find a copy because uh, the Saturn plays Japanese games. I know because I have a freaking uh, a Japanese-only release of that uh, old side scroll beat'em up D&D game that it actually came out on. Oh, shields! I don't remember what this weapon is. Oh, something's happening. What's the boss? Oh, hi. Okay. Operator's kind of cute. And here comes our first boss. This is emulating the arcade original, so there is some slowdown with some of the enemies, which is exactly how I remember, so it's kind of how I left it. Yikes! Took some hits there. Shields are low. This is going. Okay, there he is. Okay, in case, obviously, you might not know, um, that pops up when the boss gets out of your visual range, so you still have some idea where he is. And he's still taking some damage. Okay, he's coming back. I gotta grab that before he gets back. Taking that. Come back here, you son of a bitch. Come on, there we go. Oh, that did it. Yeah, so that's just special, by the way. Oh, I threaded the needle there. I think I got him. Yes. Oh, I got like it has the name of the music track on the side of the screen there. I just noticed it. That is music I remember very well from Lost in My Accident. Okay, so don't hit that button there. <laughs> Even though this is using the arcade version, it's uh, using the Saturn port, technically. So it's actually <laughs> freaking got the Japanese dialogue. Okay, well, here we go again. Okay, so we've still got the missile weapon. What's this? Oh, hello. I remember this weapon. 
very powerful. More dangerous to use than the missile for obvious reasons. So the one thing is, uh, and the, ooh, shit, the reason I annotated, oh, I didn't actually mean to get that weapon, but it's got a similar effect to the laser, it just doesn't do the same kind of damage. Um, the one thing I mentioned about them being a bomber and a bomber pilot is, uh, well, fighter bomber, is because the fighters and the bombers in this game do actually have different benefits. The fighters are actually faster and more maneuverable. The bombers tend to have a bit heavier damage and a little bit more in the way of shields. So you take a trade off. As you can see, the bombers aren't terrible in terms of maneuverability either. They're just not as quick on the maneuvering. And since she's a bomber pilot, I tend to kind of want to have her in a bomber. Damn! Well, they weren't our first. first strike there. Oh, I wanted to get that Vulcan, but I didn't get it. We got a boost. There's our operator again. And here comes the next boss track. I've never freaking forgotten the boss music from this game. And it was a long damn time ago when I played this. Whoa! You're a bastard, aren't you? Ow. Give me those, please. I need the maneuvers. Oh, okay, wow. What the... Now, evidently, this game had something of a sister game that I was not aware, aware of called uh, Wolf Fang, which is a ground combat based game with mechs, which I will probably be tackling in a later retro stuff because it actually came with this game. I think I might have got him. Are you dead or are you just breaking? Oh! Uh, it broke in half. Oh, nope, there it goes. I don't think it's dead. Why are you giving me that? No, okay, he blew himself up. And stage three. Oh, where did we get this whip? I must have grabbed it right at the end. Um, I don't remember this weapon too well. Let's see if we can grab the maneuvering thrusters safely. Got him. Ah. I'm not sure what I make of this weapon. It's okay. Not my favorite thing so far. I don't remember using this much. I tended to ow, gravitate towards the laser a lot when I could get it. I remember the Vulcan being decent, but I keep missing it. Oh fuck, those are mines. Ow. That is not helpful. It's hard to thread the needle on the mines. You end up taking some hits no matter what you do. Give it a Vulcan. Got it. This is... Ah, damn. It doesn't seem like much, but the Vulcan's actually got some decent coverage. Oh, and I ended up grabbing that again. It's not a bad weapon. I'm not too upset about it. It just seems to be really prevalent. Um, could you guys fuck off? Ow. One of the supply planes. What do you drop? Oh my dear god. It's hard getting the items sometimes, I'll definitely say that. I need that. Damn it. It's getting away from me. Whoa! Okay, that's a lot of tanks. Oh, I think we're coming up on something. Yep, there's my girl again, so we're definitely coming up on something. What the fuck is... Oh, I remember this boss. Jeez. He 
it's already taken off ahead of us. Give me the maneuver. Got it. Well, come on back here, jackass. Oh, wow, that's a lot of bullshit coming out of that thing. Just moved up out of range again. Now, depending on which mode you played, I may not be in the right mode for it, but depending on which mode you played, there was a chance after X amount of time the boss would just fucking escape and you would get a more big reduced score. Whoa! I don't want to be around the sides of that whoa thing when it does that. Drain the shitload of my shields. Okay, here, come here. Did this switch my weapon when I do that? Weird. Whoa, okay, please stop it, you jackass. We're in a bad way. Get back here, you son of a. Ah, oh, shit. We're almost out of HP or still. Armor's screwed. Come on. Oh! Damn. Come on, girl, get back in there. Give me that. Missiles will do. Get your goofy airship ass back here. I got some time extenders. Whoa, no, fuck you. Ow. Damn you. Keep flying up ahead. Jerk ass. Get back down here. Oh shit. No, I have a bomb, asshole. Oh, that should have damn near had him. Yeah, it did damn near get him. As long as I can hit him before the time runs out again. Come on. You rat bastard, get back here. Oh, shit. Come on, keep hitting him. He's getting away again. You dirty bitch. Yeah, oh my god, he's got a fraction of health. This son of a bitch. You are such an asshole. You killed so much time flying just ahead. Come on, get down here, get down here, get down here. Absolute bitch, I think I got him. Yep, there he goes. He's listing. And there he starts. Hitting. Blew his damn freaking weapons right off. I was gonna fuck up something when it lands. Here we go. Well, that's interesting. I'd forgotten about the, the weapons actually do fire differently depending on which button you're using. But, oh, no, I don't want the clusters. Ah, ow, give me the lasers. Especially for these mines. It's easy to get rid of the mines with the lasers. And thank you for the armor. What a mess. I need that. Fuck off, you. Maneuvers, thank you. Hey, get out of here, you old bastard. Okay, these little guys, I remember being a massive pain. And they still are. Damn, no, I don't want the Vulcan. Ow. Got it. Oh, jeez, the amount of shit on the screen. Oh, no, I didn't want that. I was trying to keep that fucking laser. Come on, give me that. Ah, got it. What? I guess that's just the charged version of the laser. Weird. Ah, damn it. Anybody notice this was not an easy game? In particular, in the... Uh the main stages, the bosses had their own problems, but sometimes you couldn't really thread them. 
I don't know, she's back, which means we got some shit coming down. Either. What the hell are you? I don't remember you. Wait, yes I do. You got a transformation, don't you? Good lord, missiles. Yep, there he goes. Ow. Avoided some of it. Good night. Oh, that's real cute, asshole. Do you recall this guy eating up some quarters when I was playing this in the arcade? This guy in particular. Hey, asshole, come back here. Well, I hope you enjoyed that, you jig ass. Where is your HP bar, you dirty bastard? Damn you. Oh. oh, that's cute. Those fucking big shots have a magnetic field on them. There used to be a way to sneak up him in his back, but it isn't. Either I've forgotten how to do it, or I don't know what. Damn you. Can avoid some, but generally not all of it. Yep, hit, hit there at the end. Now what the hell are you back in jet mode? You dirty bitch. Where'd you go, Marius? Go away, you JS. Have another bomb. Well, more like an orbital strike, really. Jet. Ah, you. Bastard, you! Whoa! Well, lost my missiles. This can do some decent damage to him, but the problem is I'm taking a shitload of damage to hit him that way. Ah, shit! Well, he ain't dead, but I think I got him to fuck off. Where are you going, Jagass? Okay, he got away. What an asshole. Alright, folks. I think, as I pause to check my uh, time, that we're going to go ahead and stop this one here. Won't go through the whole thing for you. I'll uh, be expecting the next retro stuff to probably look at this uh, one sister game, which would be Wolf Fang. Hopefully you enjoyed checking this out. I'll catch you later.